I will show you how to make your own pool cover so that it can be much cheaper than any cover you can buy. I will show you how to do this pool cover. I will also tell you what considerations you should take if you have an outside pool. I mean, how to make this resist wind or rain. I will also tell you the advantages and disadvantages of a pool cover. And finally, I will show you how to use this pool cover so that the pool maintenance can be much easier. Let's begin. All right, to make your own pool cover that can resist the wind and the rain, you only need, first of all, you need an iron minimally galvanized pipe that has the width of the pool and a little bit more. You can see for this pool that the tube has a little bit more than the width of the pool each side. Look the other side, it has a little bit more than the width of the pool. This because your pool cover must be a little bit bigger in the width than the pool like you can see here because the pool cover has to cover all the pool and a little bit more this pipe needs to have holes every three feet for example so that this pool cover can later be able to be tied up to this tube so that you can enroll it then besides this pipe you need a structure that can hold this pipe this structure must have a diameter bigger than the one of the pipe so that it can later roll normally inside of this structure it must have more width than the height because that way it won't tend to go down you can see here the diameter that this tube must have so that it can resist the weight of the very pool cover in the middle be sure to make this structure of a metal that is at least galvanized it would be better if it's stainless steel for example once you have this structure the only thing left is for you to have something to use to enroll this pool cover this let me show you can be something like this which could be called a crank that you just need to insert to the pool cover and like I do you can use something like this adjust it a little and I can enroll now easy this pool cover so that I can take it away whenever I need and finally you need the pool cover the material of the pool cover can be anyone that does not allow for water to go from one side to the other for example here I am using any owning material that is not the biggest quality and this one has over two years being used for example and it's still working fine obviously the better the material the more years you will be able to use it so now let's see how to install this to the pool so that it does not go away with the wind you will need to put some stakes on the floor so that you can then tie the cover up in many points see here i will show you how to do and how to install these stakes use stakes of any type or even works just by making holes in the ground in my case i added some ropes to the stakes to make it much more economical once you have your pool cover installed and well tied up it's about time to do the maintenance of the pool having the pool cover on First of all, don't worry about the rain because the water of the rain will be on top and it won't get into the pool. In there, lots of dirt will accumulate with the days and you only need to have algaecite whenever you already have water upon your pool cover. That way, algae won't grow in there and it won't smell bad. Obviously, if you can vacuum the water that accumulates in your pool cover, you can do it. And to do the maintenance of the pool water, you still need 
to have between one to three parts per million of chlorine all the time. To do that, you can add the chlorine by taking a corner of the pool cover, for example, like I show you right now, and add the chlorine over there. These chlorine levels will last much more than they did before you had the pool cover. Just three parts per million of chlorine could last even for months. Just use the app Manage Your Pool to calculate how much chlorine you need to add to raise the levels to three parts per million. And you also need to control pH and always have it between 7.2 to 7.6. And that's all the maintenance you need to give to the pool during the days or months that you will have your pool cover installed. Then whenever you want to use the pool, don't worry about all the dirt that is on the pool cover. You just need to shock that little bit of water you might have upon the pool cover and you will be surprised because it is a very small amount of chlorine you will need to use so that that water, whenever you take away the pool cover, can get into the pool and doesn't affect your pool water. And also you don't need to worry about all that dirt that is on your pool cover cover because when you take it away you can see here that all that dirt will go to the bottom in just one hour and even having the pool cover the bottom of the pool will get dirty so anyway you have to vacuum the bottom sending the water to waste you can see that when you vacuum the pool you will take away all that dirt that fell from the pool cover so that's why you don't need to worry about all that dirt that is in your pool cover. And then you just need to continue to do the regular maintenance of your pool by entering the app Manage Your Pool, Actions section and Daily Maintenance. You can see there everything you need to, to do so that your water is always crystal clear and ready for swimming. And that's everything for this video. Now you know how to do and use an exterior pool cover. If you liked it, subscribe because I upload one new video with the best info about pools for you every week.